Hi Henry's House friends, this is our 13th art lesson. Today we're going to make art to look like a cactus. So a cactus is a type of plant that doesn't need much water. It usually lives in the desert, but I have a couple in my room that I'll show you. Okay, so here are some of the plants that I have in my room. These ones are called succulents. See, there's a lot of variety. They're pretty tall. And this little one in here is gonna be a cactus, like what we're gonna make. This one is a cactus. So these little things, these aren't spiky, but the ones down here are really spiky. And here's some little ones that I've got growing. That's all of them. So we're gonna make our art look like a cactus. So this would also be a really cool one in your window. It might look like, look like you have a little plant up. So for today's lesson, you need a white piece of paper. You need a lot of different color markers. You need scissors, a piece of brown paper, glue stick, and green paint with a paintbrush. Or you can use finger paint. I don't have finger paint, so I'm gonna use paintbrush to paint on my hand. So if you don't have brown paper, you can also just use a brown marker and um, color it when we're done. So step one is to make the plant of the cactus. So for this, I'm gonna use my paintbrush and I'm gonna get my green paint and I'm gonna paint my hand. So it's, it's gonna be pretty messy. And I wanna make sure I get enough paint on here to make a print on my paper. So I'm getting my hand really dirty here, all covered. All right, so now my hand is totally green. I'm gonna try and print this into the middle of my paper. So I'm gonna go right here, I'm gonna press my hand down, and I'm gonna push all my fingers down so all the paint is on there. Now I'm gonna lift up, just like that. So see how some of this has some white space in it? You might wanna print again and try and push your hand down so there's not white space. Because this is the cactus, like the body of it, so it doesn't really have white spaces, but you can leave it if you want. So I'm gonna go back down, maybe if I push my hand there, the spaces will fill in. All right, perfect. There's a little bit more filled in. You can also just use your finger and connect it like that. If you want, you could fill in this part. So I'm gonna get some more paint on my finger, fill that in. So there's the body of my cactus. So next, I'm gonna use my colors and I'm gonna make the little flowers that are on top of each part of the cactus. So I'm gonna start with my pink circle. Okay, so now I'm doing the top of the flowers that are on each part of the cactus. So I'm gonna use different colors and just do circles on the top. So these are just the top of each of my fingers that I had printed. You can do whatever colors you want because cactuses have lots of different kinds of flowers on them. So now that each top has a circle, I'm gonna use a different color and I'm gonna do dots around each circle. So here I have my blue one. I'm gonna do, that's two dots, three dots, four dots, five dots. So there's that flower. Next, I'm gonna do my pink flower I'm gonna use red dots. So I have two, three, four, five. For my orange one, I'll use yellow. So one, two, three, four, five. And then my last one, I have my flower over here. Oh, it looks like I have two more. Use red, three, four, 
five, and maybe my last one, I'll do purple. So I have one, two, three, four, five. So now you can see that each flower is made. So next we're gonna use our brown paper and we're gonna make the pot. So for this part, I'm just gonna cut a little rectangle out. It could just be a little square, it could be a circle if you want your pot to be a circle. So mine looks like this. And then I'm gonna put, I'm gonna take my glue stick and I'm gonna put some glue on the back. You wanna make sure you get all the corners with your glue stick. So mine looks like this. Down here, line it up and smush it down. So there is my cactus in the pot. So here you can see each of my flowers and the five petals I have on each flower. I use different colors for every flower. There's the cactus part and then there's the pot.